hello everyone and welcome to my channel options trader today so today in this video i will tell you how the price of crude has moved in the last week and how the price of crude can move in the next week see if you look at the chart of crude what you can see whenever it made high we have seen a downfall okay whenever it goes above this particular level we have seen that it went that level and from there we have seen a downfall okay again it went up made third time high again it went down okay so again once break this particular high it went up and then came downside okay and for the fifth time we have seen that it made a high came down and now trying to move upside same pattern is following since 2020 okay it has moved upside and then break downside before that we move forward if you have any doubt regarding crude or any other commodities or forex you can mail me at stockmarkettradinglive@gmail.com and a mail id i have given in the description please watch the full video then you will understand how this technical in crude and other commodities are working and if you wish to join my telegram channel link i have given in the description you can join see if you look at this particular chart we have seen that now the price currently trading at around 115.08 ठीक है ओके सो वंस इफ इट गोज अब दैट लेवल देन वी कैन सी इट कैन टच अ लेवल ऑफ वन वन फाइव पॉइंट सेवन जीरो ओके एंड इफ दिस सस्टेन वन वन फाइव पॉइंट सेवन जीरो दिस पर्टिकुलर लेवल वी कैन सी इट कैन मूव फर्दर अपसाइड टू वर्ड्स अ लेवल ऑफ वन वन सिक्स पॉइंट वन वन सिक्स पॉइंट फोर फोर एट ओके एंड वंस दिस लेवल क्रॉस्ड अपसाइड बिकॉज दिस दिस रेजिस्टेंस वन वन सिक्स पॉइंट फोर एट इज अ वीक रेजिस्टेंस ओके weak resistance so once if it goes above this level we can see it can move further upside towards a level of 129 this is the what resistance once if it crosses this level we can see it can move further upside but if we look at previous years chart previous years chart that means you have to understand here that this is the uh, range where the market was there but it the high was around 115 so it has already crossed this particular range so what we can see the now the next range we can see if it sustain above this level we can see it can move to a level of 117.51 and from there we can see it can move further upside towards a level of 120.11 and if the price sustain above more, more then we can see a level of 122.18 and from there we can see it can move to a level of 130 1 after 129 we can see a level of 134 also okay now as you know that market is uncertain we can see that this particular uh level sustain or resistance got weak we can see it can move further upside but suppose if the price didn't sustain this particular level what we can see suppose if the price didn't sustain this particular level we can see it can come down again to a level of 112.66 dollars okay and if the price didn't sustain that level also then we can see it can come down to a level of 110.72 okay suppose if the price didn't sustain that level also then we can see it can come down to a level of 109.43 Okay, and if it goes below that level, then we can see it can touch a level of one zero seven point one zero seven point four nine. Suppose if the price didn't sustain that level also, then we can see it can come down to a level of one zero five point eight three. And once if it goes below that level, then we can see it can touch a level of one zero four point two six. Okay, suppose if the price sustain one zero four point two six, then didn't sustain that level, then we can see a level of hundred. Okay, once hundred goes down. because this is the these level all the support which is already being tested here so probability is very high we can see it can further fall towards a level of 98 and once if it goes below 98 then we can see it can come down to a level of 95 and once 95 sustain then sustain because what is the problem that this is the range where low is was around 95 so once if it goes below this particular level we we can see a level of 92.97 and from there we can see it can come down to a level of 85 which is a strong support which is a strong support so once if it didn't sustain this level or if it bounce back from this level then we can see further upside or if it glow goes below that level then we can see it can touch a level of 77 dollars again any doubt regarding this you can mail me so if you are trading you have to understand if you are trading with suppose 10000 dollars okay try to trade with 10 to 15% of your capital per trade that is around 1000 to 1500 okay and risk should be around 0.5 to 1% that is around 50 to 100 dollars okay per trade so if suppose if you take five trades also and you lose all five trades maximum of 500 okay then exit the day for the trade because you already lost from um, your limit 
okay so in the next day what you can do is you can focus more on profit rather than this recovering this particular loss okay this is what people do uh, they try to recover a particular loss beca because of this they lose their full capital this is what i teach in my workshop how to overcome all these losses so uh, you can mail me and then we can work out on the timing so hope you like the video and if you like the video please give a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel please subscribe it